Actually, now that we have the structure and the movement more or less, the movement that we want, we have to start adding the volumes here that they are the volumes of the legs, the, the, the front and the back leg and also the stomach and the chest. We will reshape it and then it's going to come out this leg and the rear leg too here. That it would be more or less what we are going to start doing after that. First, we are going to define the real leg that maybe we need to put more material here. That's part of the real leg. And the path that is here. Now this part has to be added, you know, this leg and the shoulder. The shoulder is going to be in here, that part. We have to add kind of quite big volume here. And then this volume is going to be going down. In order to m create the other leg. All these features, they are very subtle there. They are not so exaggerated, but they are. And then we have to respect that, and, uh, and that's part of the, of the good figuring. Everything is put together. There is no limbs out. Means that it's going to be a very strong figuring that it will be easy to keep for long. Then these two legs they are together. Here we put one leg here, one leg there. We have to put the two legs together. Then one of the things that we can do easy is just push them together. Then we have to add in here that part that it's where the two legs they are joined and also where the chest emerge. Then also, we see here that we have to define the head and the lower part that maybe we need more material in here. Okay, now that we make this side, that still it's not perfect, but it's very close. Next, we are going to make that side, that is all this, and then we are going to reshape the head. 